All right, uh, let's go make a rectangle at a uh, hundred millimeters, fifty millimeters, uh, which is uh, fifty millimeters by fifty millimeters wide. Okay, and let's go ahead and check if that works with my laser. Uh, center is out. Now, is this entire thing uh, visible? That it is. Okay, let's go ahead and put this in the engrave. Let me change the engrave settings to do uh, 45 millimeters a second. Okay, and let's go ahead and burn that. Alright, now we're going to select this really fast and we're going to load up our uh, settings and config windows and go ahead and set the current to the current so it's in the upper right hand corner. Go ahead and home that. Should pop straight back to the corner. Perfect. Okay, now uh, since this was 50-50, I'm going to make this 50 50. Okay. So there we go. And now this perfectly overlaps this and is located now at 00. zero. Alright. Uh, now let me load up the camera really fast, which I cannot do because I'm currently recording it. One second. Okay. I'm no longer recording my own camera. So let's go ahead and move this thing out of the way. Hopefully block some of the light. Uh, let me get rid of the paper. <clears throat> All right. Um, the important thing is not... Uh, the paper existing it's that I can see the difference between one and the other so I need to be able to see the perspective and let's get that kind of exactly at the corner that's yeah, more corner corner and right there that should be about perfect okay now I say correct perspective and now you can see that my camera is uh, this white box now. Go ahead and do aspect. So it should uh, properly be the item. Now let me uh, put in a tiny... Okay. Let me go ahead and reconnect the camera because it did an update for the fact that I put this here. And uh, this is with the corrected perspective. So now we have this. Now I go ahead and get rid of that. And let's go ahead and do uh, text. Hello. And uh, scale that by five. Okay. And since it's rotated, we're going to rotate it there. And put it about there. And let's go ahead and give this a shot. We're going to put it in the raster here. Uh, 150. Let's up this a bunch to say... Uh, 300 and probably about 300 okay and go ahead and run mm. 
Okay, that is not strong enough to see on the piece, so I'm going to go ahead and just put this at a thousand and run it again. All right, now the laser's properly firing all the way. All right, and that should about do it. And here's what it looks like. Okay, and so it's off by about four millimeters. Now, if I go back to uh, my camera and I turn off the thing, you can tell that it's located uh, that the camera itself is at a pretty spectacularly large angle. Uh, now, if I home again, that's right, I unplugged it. Oh, I might have touched my camera. Uh, correct perspective. Yeah, I lost the light. Oh, well. Uh, you can apparently do it like this, but it's uh, going to be off by a bit. All right, uh, having nudged my camera, I now have to move my perspective lines again. Uh, this item, the piece of paper, will not have changed positions. Neither will my homed position. Uh, I might actually have to move this in order to get a nice shadow to see the paper. All right, and that should about do it. All right, uh, correct perspective. Yeah, let's go ahead and turn on the aspect ratio. Okay, so let's uh, give it another shot. I'm gonna use the same thing, other side. Okay, let's go ahead and reconnect the camera so you can see that it exists. All right, let's update this. All right, and hit numpad minus to rotate it here, and rotate it here. Now I'm gonna try it here. Now I know I tried to hit it on this part, but it was whatever, but this is center mass for it, and it's, uh, it's a little bit tall, so I'm thinking that maybe I could uh, get some you know, victory this way. Okay, so here we go. And let's just uh, hit it button. All right. Uh, now, I'm pretty sure you can't quite see, but that is pretty dead on. Uh, here's what it looks like. That's actually remarkably close. All right, I'm gonna try one more time. That should be entirely in there. Go ahead and select this, delete it. Uh, text, arms are heavy, scale uh, seven. All right, let's go here, it's very slightly off. Let's make it a little bigger and let's put it low because I know it tends to get high. So, all right, that is probably 
roughly good. Uh, let's go ahead and home again. Now, remember my home is actually offset, so went out through the beginning. All right, uh, let me uh, fire a pulse there. Uh, let's go ahead and open this up. All right, looked about just exactly at the corner. And let's go. Uh, oh, this text isn't actually in the raster, so it was instantly done. All right, let's go. All right, uh, from the looks of it, it's pretty spot on. All right, I'm going to have to call that a success. Uh, let me... Here's a picture. All right, um, thanks for watching.